Hey, Austin, what are we going to draw today? A tree house. A tree house. We hope you're going to follow along with us. We always hope you follow along because art is always better with... Markers. Friends. Friends. <laughs> it does help to have something to draw with. We're using markers, <laughs> some paper, and... Something to color with. All right, you ready to start? Yes. We're first going to draw our tree towards the top of our paper because it's up in the air, right? We're going to draw a horizontal line like this. This is for the bottom of our tree house. There you go. Then we're gonna draw the sides, and we're gonna draw it going up, and we're gonna draw another one over here going up. Yeah. Now we're gonna draw another line, but we're gonna draw it close to this one. So we're gonna draw it like that. Oh, well, I like how close you drew it. Okay, now this is where the door is gonna be for our tree house. So let's draw two more lines going up, And they're shorter, yeah, there you go. And then at the top, let's connect them. Now let's draw the roof to our house. We're gonna draw an upside down V to connect the left two lines. Yeah, and then let's draw a line that comes across to connect the side. Okay, now let's do a little line coming out over here and a little line over here. Okay, and then we're gonna draw another upside down V to connect those little lines. <laughs> Good, and then let's draw another horizontal line coming across. This is so the roof looks thick. Yeah, there you go, and then we can connect those. Okay, let's draw the top of our roof now this line we're gonna draw, and it's gonna be shorter. We're not gonna go all the way across. So we can draw it here, and then maybe stop right there. Then we're gonna draw a diagonal line to come down and connect. We did it! Now let's add a window on the side of our tree house. So we're gonna draw an L shape right here on the side. That's for the bottom of our rectangle. And then we're gonna draw an upside down L to connect it. All right, there's our tree house. Oh, let's do, let's do one more thing. Let's add another line right here on the bottom of our house. Let's extend each side out further. And this is so that you have a little platform to stand on, on your tree house. Yeah, and then let's extend this line up here a little further out to match. Yeah, there you go. And then we can connect those two lines. Awesome, we did it, we finished our tree uh, house. I mean, we finished the house, what are we missing? The trees. Yeah, the tree, to make it a tree house. Let's first draw the trunk coming up to our tree. So let's start down here, and we're gonna draw two lines that come down, one on each side like that. Yeah, there you go. And then let's draw it curving at the very bottom. These are for the roots that are going into the ground. Then we can draw the grass. I'm going to draw a zigzag line that connects the two tree lines and goes past for the ground. Okay, now let's draw the tree, the leaves up here at the top of our tree. We're going to draw popcorn lines or cloud lines. We're going to start over here and we're going to draw bumpy lines like this, so some of the lines can be, or some of the curves, the bumps can be small and some can be big. Yeah. Good job. All right, now let's do the same thing over here. I'm gonna draw another one on the right side. Some bumps are big and some are small. You can mix them up. Oh, it's looking awesome, keep going. All right, now let's draw another one up here on the top. I'm gonna to start here on the roof and draw bumps, come around. This one's really big and it's gonna connect in. Keep going, you can make it even bigger, yeah. There you go, oh, that was a big one, I like that. And then you can connect in to the roof or you just keep going. Yeah, I like how you drew yours. I'm gonna add one more little popcorn shape over here on this side because I still have extra space. Now if you want, you could add 
one over here. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. One like that. Yeah, there you go. And you can even add one over here. Yeah. Now let's add a few more details. Let's add two lines right here. This is for the brace on our tree house so it doesn't fall out of the tree. <laughs> And let's add some branches. So first I'm gonna draw a water line. So a bumpy line that's kind of upside down so that it looks like water, like waves on an ocean. Can you do that? Yeah. Now we're gonna draw the branches coming out of the tree and connecting to our tree house. So I'm gonna draw one line that connects. Yeah, and then we can draw another one over here. Then inside, I'm gonna draw two little V shapes for the branches. Our tree kinda of looks like broccoli, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> That's okay, okay, <laughs> let's keep going. Now let's do one more thing. Let's add a ladder going up to our tree house. So I'm gonna draw a line, comes down like this, and another line right next to it. Yeah. Now let's draw another line right next to each of those first lines we drew. This is the rope on the side of our ladder. Two really skinny lines next to each other. Here you go, one more. Right next to it, good. At the very bottom, let's connect those two lines. Let's draw the ladder or the steps in the ladder. So let's draw up here, we're gonna draw two lines next to each other going horizontal. So these are going vertical, and these are horizontal. That's for one step. Then let's come down here, leave a little space, draw another step, and we'll repeat that and go all the way down our ladder. All right, Austin, we did it. We finished our tree house. It looks really cool, except it's gonna look even cooler once we do what? Color it. Yeah, we need to color it. This part, we're gonna fast forward, but at the end, if you want, you can pause the video to match the same coloring. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Job on coloring your tree house. Do you think it looks better all colored in? Yeah. Yeah, me too. I hope our art friends are gonna take time to color their drawings also. Now you guys at home could also add even more details. You could add lights and even a club sign and a bucket to lift cool things up to your tree house with. We hope you have a lot of fun drawing your tree house. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we hope you take time to add extra things to your drawings. What else could they add? Like a dog in the bucket. Oh, in the bucket. Why, why would he be in the bucket? Because he can't come up the ladder. <laughs> That's true. He can't climb up the ladder so you could bring him up on the bucket. <laughs> you draw a little puppy sticking out. <laughs> And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye! Hey, parents and teachers, join our monthly membership and download our app. You can watch all of our art lessons in a safe, distraction-free environment. In the app, you can also download lessons to watch without any Wi-Fi connection. Just visit artforkidshub.tv to join.